Welcome back to the final part of this FMTV series on 5G versus Wi-Fi. Now, history shows that 5G will eventually dominate the communications landscape. I began my journalism career writing about local area networks. In 1997, I even published a book on high-speed lands for McGraw-Hill. Back then, vendors and standards groups were pushing eight different LAN options, which led to a big industry bun fight. Eventually, Ethernet emerged victorious, mainly because the industry wanted one simple consolidated network rather than many. And the same dynamic exists today. When faced with a network fork in the road, the industry prefers a single route. Hence, NFE's shift to cloud, ATM's loss to IP, and MPLS being overtaken by SD-WAN. This ongoing Wi-Fi versus 5G debate may take decades to settle, but ultimately, it's a Highlander. There can be only one. 5G's dominance is assured not just by its technology, but by a fundamental shift in communications role in the 21st century. We've moved beyond basic functions like phone calls or emails. Digital tech now underpins all aspects of human life, culture, politics, industry, warfare. It's a pervasive ecosystem demanding ubiquitous connectivity. That means cloud, optical networks and AI, yes, but also, and this is written, 5G.